welcome back. So school is back in session. That means your cars, your counters, your bags overflowing with papers. So we have professional organizer Linda Reinberger from Organize Consolidate Declutter here to help us tame this paper problem. So first off, what uh, what supplies do we need to take care of all of this? Well, you want to you want to have one of two things. You want to have a art supply box and a file for important papers. Because when we bring home a stack like this, we don't want to have to save all of it. You want to keep the ones that are the most important. You want to put the things that, you know, are really causing their creating their uh, imagination. You put them up on the refrigerator, and then when you're done with that, you put them in the box. So just a couple days up on the fridge, and then... Right, the next level comes through. And they forget through. about it so quickly. Right, but then at the end of the school year, what you do is you ask them to pick their favorite 10. And then what you do is you put out a little printout mm -hmm. of their name, what grade, you know, kind of some special things about that year. And then you clip it together at the bottom of the bin. So then you have a stack of the different years of their different artwork, how their creativity is, is blossomed. And it's not just paperwork. It's not just the color the, in, the, in the lines in a coloring book. Well, that's good to get them to get involved and let them pick because yes. you don't want to throw something that they're very attached to. Exactly. Um, how, how else can you get kids involved in the organizing? Well, one thing I like to, I like to do with my kids is that um, we had a binder so that they would put their activities and things in for each year. So I like their school pictures, mm -hmm. their report cards, little books that they made, and that's where it would go. They would know to put it into their grade year folder, and then the folder goes right into, into, the, into the box. Okay, tell me about this binder right here. This binder is a special education binder. I had a child who was in special ed, and you do a lot of meetings, you do a lot of going to the school and having to meet with the teachers and everybody and so this is so I knew where everything is all his IEPs all his medical records his immunizations any therapists that we had gone to any uh, doctors that we had gone to it, everything was in this folder so if there was any question at the school I had the information well very cool well I need you to come organize my life but that sounds <laughs> like it might be a segment for another day so thank you for being here and for more organizing tips you can log on to Linda's website we have all that information on the bottom of your screen screen.